Hey guys, guess who's back? My mom! Hey guys! Oops! Hey guys, guess who's back? My mom! Hey guys, it's so great to be back! My mom needed to get settled when she sat down. I'm pretty sure that you guys know that I had surgery. I think when we mentioned that once or twice. I did. I had surgery on my back and it made it really hard to walk and sit. And honestly, I was just really tired. So thankfully, Lindley and Gregory helped me out with these videos. It was super cool to also get to spend time seeing faces that were familiar from church. I really enjoyed our special readers this summer. So this is our last special reader video for a while. You're probably wondering why. Well, this Sunday, we are kicking off a brand new Sunday school year. Mr. Bruce and I are inviting you guys to join us in a special Zoom meeting. In our Zoom meeting, we will get to see all of our friends from church. We will say good morning to each other, and we also get to say good morning to God. We're going to sing some songs, and we are going to read our scripture lesson for the day. This year during Sunday school, you'll get videos on Sunday with myself and Mr. Bruce, and you will also get a video during the middle of the week. That video during the middle of the week will be us just reading stories to you guys. Those stories are going to help us to understand our Bible lesson for the week. It's going to help us to make connections. Those connections help us to remember things for a super long time. So let's go sing a song with Mr. Bruce and then we'll come back for our last special reader for a while. Hey friends, I may have gotten a little carried away with this week's song and by that I mean you might hear more than one of me. Thanks, Mr. Bruce. That was a great song. Okay, our special reader for today is a mom and a dad. They're reading the story together, which makes it even more exciting. We have a special reader today that is a mom of two little boys and a dad of two little boys. We are gonna have Miss Erica and Mr. Keenan. Hi friends. Hi. I'm Keenan. And I'm Erica. And we're gonna read you a story. The Wind That Obeyed.
Come, said Jesus, get into the boat. Let's go for a ride. Jesus got into the boat. Jesus' friends got into the boat. Splash went the little waves. Splash, splash. Jesus' friends began to make the boat go. Pull, push, pull, push. But Jesus was tired. He lay down in the back of the boat and went to sleep. Now while the boat was going, the wind started to blow. Ooh, 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 the wind was blowing hard. It blew the men's hair. It blew their clothes. It blew the water. Ooh. Soon the little boat was rolling up and down, up and down. Then some water came into the boat. Splash! Went the big waves. Splash! Splash! Jesus' friends were wet. They were afraid too. Let's tell Jesus, they said. Save us, Lord. Wake up. Wake up. Jesus opened his eyes. He saw the water splash. He heard the wind blow. But he said, why are you afraid? I'm here. Then Jesus talked to the wind. He talked to the water. He said, shh, be still. And do you know what happened? What do you think happened? The wind stopped blowing. The water stopped splashing. They both got still as could be. Jesus' friends looked around. Everything was quiet and safe. Who is Jesus, they said. Even the wind and the water do what he says. I know who Jesus is. Do you? Jesus made the wind. Jesus made the water. Jesus is God. What did you learn? Jesus took care of his friends. Jesus is God. He can take care of you and me as well. Jesus is awesome, isn't he? And he can see us through anything that we're going through especially in these times. Thank you, friends. See you soon. Thank you so much, Ms. Erica and Mr. Keenan. I hope you guys all have a fantastic week. I'm looking forward to seeing you on Sunday morning at 10 o'clock. We sent your mom and dad an email about it. If they didn't see it, it's in flock notes, okay? And don't forget to wash those hands. I love you and I'll see you on Sunday. Bye.